Hi everyone, George here, and today's video is all about the HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor. We will give some details about it, explain how it works, and at the last part we will create an Arduino sketch to test its functionality. The HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor uses a sound frequency to determine the distance of an object just like how dolphins and bats senses its surroundings for navigation. Ultrasonic sound frequency can be found just above the upper limit of human hearing capacity, which is 20 Hz to 20,000 Hz. Ultrasonic sensors is composed of two sound transducers, one for the transmitter, and another one for the receiver. The ultrasonic sensor works as follows. The transmitter sends a signal and when the signal hits an object, the signal is reflected. Then the reflected signal is then received by the receiver. The time it takes for the transmitted signal to be reflected back to the sensor is proportionally equivalent to the distance it travels according to the speed of sound. To calculate the distance of an object, we will use the following formula. Distance is equal to the duration multiplied to the speed of sound. But we need to consider that the signal is sent, hits an object, then reflected back. So taking it in consideration, instead we will use the following formula, which is distance is equal to the duration divided by 2 multiplied to the speed of sound. The speed of sound is approximately 343 meters per second. But since the return value of ultrasonic sensor is in microsecond, we will use 0.0343 centimeter per microsecond as the speed of sound. The pin assignment of HCSR04 is as follows. BCC should be connected to positive 5 volts DC. Trig pin or trigger pin is an input signal which is used to activate the sending of ultrasonic signal bursts. Echo pin is an output signal which returns a TTL high equivalent to the duration of travel from transmitting to receiving. Ground pin should be connected to common ground. This module provides a distance measurement between 2 cm to 400 cm with an accuracy of 3 mm at a maximum angle of 15 degrees. For more details, you may check the data sheet Links will be provided in the description. In order to test the functionality of ultrasonic sensor, we will need the following materials. An HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor, an Arduino Uno microcontroller board, a breadboard, and some jumper wires. So let's get started. So now, let us build our test circuit. First, connect our ultrasonic sensor in the breadboard, like this. Connect our control signals for the trigger and echo pin, like this. I will be using Digital pin 9 and 10 for the echo and 
trigger signal. So, I'm connecting trigger pin to pin 9 and echo pin to pin 10. Then, I will be connecting our supply, voltage supply, BCC to 5 volts and ground pin to Arduino ground. So, connect this to ground and 5 volts. That's all. Now it's done. Now we are here in my desktop. So basically, we will measure the distance from our ultrasonic sensor up to our an object, which is this power bank. So I already prepare our Arduino sketch, which is this one in our desktop so basically I just define an echo pin as connected to digital pin 10 and the trigger pin is connected to digital pin 9 we define a, a variable which is long for the, for the duration and for the distance we set up the echo pin and trigger pin echo pin as input and the trigger pin as output then we send a setup complete for our test then in the loop first we just make sure that our trigger pin is low then we wait for 5 microseconds then we send a high signal to trigger pin then wait for 10 microseconds then we return the digit uh, the trigger pin to TTL low then we read the duration using the pulse in function so read the signal from the sensor a high pulse whose duration is time in microseconds from sending of the ping to the reception of its echo of an object so the return value here is in microseconds so basically the distance is equal to the duration divided by 2 multiplied to sorry this is multiplied to 0 0.0343 centimeter per microseconds then we send the uh, data to serial monitor. So distance is distance, which is the this this data in centimeter. Then let's give some delay. Delay, let's say for one second. After that, we save. Then, make sure in the tools, the correct board is selected. So, our board is an Arduino Uno, which is this one, Arduino Uno. And make sure that the correct port is selected also. After that, press Upload. Then, we will wait for the Upload Complete. now uploading and now done uploading so we will check the serial monitor setup complete distance is 20 centimeter so it's correct so let's say we move it to around 15 centimeter like this more yeah or move it closer let's say to 
9 8 cm so I think this one can go up to 2 cm so the long the longest distance it can measure is up to 4 meters so I think that's all for now I hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video please consider supporting my youtube channel by subscribing leave your comments and suggestions in the comment box thank you and have a good day bye happy tinkering